Good morning and welcome to my channel. Today, I'll be showing you guys how to have beautiful hair and ends like this for seven days. Yes, seven days straight. My hair is very curly. So what happened is once I blow dry it, it gets very oily. So to have an end like this and less oily hair, I'll show you what I do every night. Okay, so step one, take the heads off. As you can see, the roots are kind of sticked together, right? But it's still good, right? Every morning, I wash my face, so the hair over here gets wet, so it gets a little bit curly. So what I do is I grab a small brush, okay? They blow dry it, and I blow dry just here. Okay, all right, like that. So then, all good to go, right? So at night, when I come home, and at night, when I go to sleep, what I do is, I grab a brush, and I brush all my hair, okay? Let's brush it. Make sure you detangle your hair. You need to give a good brush, okay? If it's not brushed well, it's not going to give the same effect when you take it down in the morning. So make sure you brush it. Brush, brush, brush. All good. Now you twist it. Okay. Look. Twist it. Well twist. Then... Look, make sure the ends are straight here, okay? Then get a rubber band or whatever you have and just tie it up. Okay, like that. Make sure it's all the way up here because at night when you go to sleep, right? Your head is going to put against the pillow and it's not going to touch your hair up here. So that's very important. So when you wake up in the morning, five, six, seven hours later, you'll take this out, okay? And you let your hair grow, go. Of course, like I say, my hair has been seven days no wash, so it's very oily. But the ends, I'll give this, look, this beautiful ends, you see? Curly ends. So now I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hair and I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show, I'm gonna show it to you how to blow dry a curly hair. Okay, so I'll be right back. Hang on. <laughs> Welcome back everybody. Now we are in step two, okay? Now with the hair washed, see? I washed it three times with shampoo. I use this shampoo here, Joico. Okay, the blue one, and I used Joico conditioner. Using a good shampoo, it's really good, okay? The results are better. So if you guys are interested, I'll talk about my shampoos later, okay? So now, as you can see, I have a very curly hair and we need to start getting going. So let's divide the hair, okay? I brush it already, okay? Hair is brushed. Now we're gonna divide, okay? Make sure to have a time to do your hair, okay? So you work on your hair better. So, okay, first step. Then the back, I like to do it twice, like this, okay? Okay, now the top. Brush your hair, guys, before you do this, okay? All right. On this side. Okay. 
Okay, this side. I will start from the bottom, okay? Let me take this one out. Start from here. Okay. Now we'll go to we are going to use some heat protection. Why? Because you don't want to burn your hair, right? So a good heating protection. It protects your hair from getting burned from the blow dryer or the flat item. Okay, I used a little bit, okay? And I like to use each, se each section itself because I get on all of it, okay? There you go. Now we're going to blow dry. Ready? Now guys, this is very important. The ends of the ends, right? You have to work really good if you want to have the curly ends for seven days, okay? So now I'm going to work extremely good on my ends. So take a look. A good blow dryer helps. Okay, now you let it cool down a little bit, okay, and then you just let it go, and look at the ends. You like the effect? It looks good, right? Look, closer. Ha ha. So this is what you want. So make sure when you're doing the ends, it needs the, the brush, it needs to go through very smooth, smooth, see, very smooth. So keep rolling the brush like this. Don't stop. And then when it's smooth, you just roll it up. Put some heat. Take the heat off. Let it cool down. And let the brush go. Okay? Okay, guys. I hope you guys got it. So let me continue with my hair. And I come back to show you the results. Okay? All right. We're back. So I did the bottom, okay? Now is this the first layer, so now the second layer. Okay? So here got a little dry, so we're going to go ahead and spray a little bit of water. There you go. Not too wet, not too dry. Okay? And I will show you guys the amount of the heat protector that I'm going to use. Okay? Look, one squeezed this much. You rub it against your hand. Start from half way down and work to the top. You don't need to get on your roots because your hair, it's going to get very oily. So that's it. Let's start. 
I'm gonna show you guys one more time, okay? Smaller brush, and then I'll we'll use this medium brush. Okay. So get the roots good, tight. Down, okay, the blow dryer going down. One more time. Here you want your hair straight, so you work down. And then you go up. Okay. Now, if you need to detangle, detangle. If you need to, Wet your ends a little bit more, do it, okay? So now we're gonna work halfway down. Remember, you have to smooth your ends. So I got a second brush, okay? Medium brush. Because I want the curls not too tiny. I want them longer, okay? I'm pulling down like this. When I press it, I'll pull it down, okay? So the hair will get tight. So you let it cool a little bit. Then you roll it down. Then you brush it. Look. Okay, let's continue. I'll be back soon. Okay, we're back. Now, it's only left the front of it, okay? So I'll show you how to dry the front of your head. So now we're gonna go back, go ahead and put your hair back, okay? And twist it. Just twist your hair going down, okay? And put it back behind your ears. Twist it again. Okay. That's it, it's there. So of course, by the time I got here, it's drier. So let's wet a little bit. Guys, here I'm gonna section too. I have too much of a hair. If you dry too much of a hair, what's gonna happen is it's not really gonna dry well. And you're not gonna get all around it so it's better if you do it you know little by little okay, this much here remember don't really use it on your roots okay so this section this will be the last one so i'll put it on the other side okay now we get this <clears throat> Okay, let's begin.
okay it's good now we will brush it okay we're gonna start now we're gonna work halfway down so i'm gonna wet my ends see this takes time so you go to the salon they don't really have time to dry your hair very well because they have to do a fast job so at home you take your time have too much of a hair on the brush so you know you can take half of this section and do half so let's do this side more because it did not got a good grip that the brush is like getting stuck through it stop it roll out and do it again or if you need to brush it brush it okay don't really damage your hair that much go slow on your hair back twist it with the other one okay now we go to the last but not least here okay so smaller brush but this time right here my hair is thinner so I don't want to use like a hotter bristles. I want to use a softer one. Okay, because the hair here is finer and I don't want to pull it off. Okay, so first we're going to start here. Way down, it needs to be wet. Remember, not much. Now, a different brush, right? Now we're at the end, so you want to curl it.
So now guys, I'm gonna do the retouching here. Okay, so I'll go ahead, see? Here, I didn't really pull it. So I'll go ahead. I'll tie my hair back. Okay. Okay, now I'll wet here. In here. Okay. See the hair very fine. So it doesn't need much heat to straight it. So with a soft bristle, we're gonna pull it back. Okay. Push it back. Okay. gonna check out the results right oh yeah a good tip uh, here now is we having a dry weather okay it's very cold but if you know if you are in a country that now it's warm and you think your hair will get frizzy I advise you to do some flat item but don't touch the ends okay uh, so you'll ruin the ends actually if you straight the ends with the flat iron so if you can just go on top with the flat iron and flat iron all the way through the half of it, okay? So because I did my hair, I pull it down and up, I got a volume, you see? It's not a flat hair. So if I want a flat hair, I only will blow dry it down. But if I want a more of movement and more of like higher, roots right not so tight like this i do i make sure i blow dry up okay so guys this is it remember when you go to sleep brush brush your hair tie it all the way up okay tie it all the way up twist 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 okay make sure the ends are straight Use something loose, okay? Nothing too tight, so so your hair won't be marked in uh you know in the next day. So this is it. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys practice because practice make it perfect, right? I hope you guys really enjoy my video today, and into the next video. Bye.